Here we would like to continue to show more face dimming applications and this time we're going to dim down lights. Here we have a few down lights that we obtained from our retail partners. We have either replaced the non-dimmable LED drivers at the back or simply match the downlights with face dimmable LED drivers ourselves. Once the face dimmer and the dimmable constant current LED driver series have been selected, the only thing that's left is the, series, is the selection of appropriate LED drivers to match the downlights. For face dimmable constant current LED drivers, you can consider the rated constant current as the maximum output current from the dimmable drivers for the lights. This is because as we dim the lights, the output voltage of the dimmable LED driver will drop, which changes the LED's forward current, and hence the brightness according to the LED's own characteristics. As if you plan to do the replacement, correct understanding of the various voltages of the LED lights and the proposed dimmable drivers would be important. In the following, we are going to show the initial steps for preparing the replacement. Here we have a down light with a port label, like this. In this case, not a single LED driver is provided for reference. With so little information, we are not sure whether we should be using a callable constant voltage air driver or a constant current LED driver with output voltage in a similar range. As a matter of fact, if your intention is to use a constant current phase dimmable LED driver with output voltage around 12 volt, you would not succeed in this case. For an unfamiliar lighting fixture, before any driver selection, our suggestion is to first validate the actual operating condition. This would be a good reference point for the driver selection. To validate that, while we may use a programmable power supply, a very simple solution suggested here is to use a Minwell APC-8-350, which is a tiny 8 watt 50 mA non-dimmable LED drivers or the like, to light it up first. As soon as the light is on, we can see the actual output from the drivers around 21 volt. This is almost a double of what's written on the port of label. So it would only be confusing and frustrating if we had selected this driver based on the misleading information for both. If we want to achieve them to off, it's necessary to find out the minimum board voltage just enough to switch on the light. Every LEDs would be different and so we suggest to use a programmable power supply to identify that. Earlier on, we have identified that the, for this downlight, the minimum board voltage is around 16 volt. So the operating voltage range that we should be looking for is in fact from 1621 volt at 350 milliamp. Ideally, we shall be matching the phase dimmable LED driver with the output voltage range that covers both the operating voltage at the desired board current and the minimum board voltage. But in reality, we are all restricted by the available products, so sometimes we face the selections based on different minimum output voltage and the output voltage cutoff values. In summary, we have shown that satisfactory dimming performance can be easily achieved with the compatible dimmer driver combination and by the right driver selection. By before so selecting the right driver, do not forget to validate and or find out the actual output conditions, operating currents, operating voltage, and do not simply take the product description for granted. Clearly understand the appropriate output voltage range to look for and kick off the driver selection process. And let's conclude our video here. To learn more about our dimming technology and portal benefits, please check out other videos in the series. Once again, thank you for watching.